FBE with the brand new champion. We have been waiting hours to play her. We got Yumi, new kitty cat champion support, guys. So as you can see, we already start with a point into W. So you don't have to level it up. And look at that. Get used to it because this is what you're going to be doing for most of the game, guys. So uh, we do get a free point to W, and it doesn't look like it costs anything. Zero mana cost. So we're going to go ahead and level up our Q. And uh, while we're waiting for our jungler to connect, uh, we'll show off the dances and stuff. That is adorable. Slightly less adorable. Jen, get away from me. Okay, guys, this, I already love this champion. I'm in love. I'm in. It's love at first sight. We we might be playing uh we might be playing four v five because our jungler didn't connect. But guys, this is world's first brand new uh, gameplay of Yumi. Gonna be showing you how to carry with her right out of the box. So our passive is Bop and Block. It's uh, auto t based attack where every other auto attack gives us a shield and restores mana. So it's kind of similar to uh, Zerath. In fact, has a 20, se 20 second cooldown. All right. So let's go ahead and attach to our ADC and do a Q and it just kind of guides it. That's really cool. It's like a little laser pointer. So what you want to do, guys, I think, is kind of start a fight and take some damage and then jump onto your ADC. So like, if you want to bait someone into like using their flash and ignite on you and then jump onto your ADC where you're nice and safe, check a potion, throw the Q around the, uh, the minions, not quite hitting her there yet. This is too funny man, I literally am just latched onto my ADC. Oop, got her. Oh, I'm gonna disattach for that, hit her with a couple auto attacks, jump onto him, heal him. It's a pretty juicy heal and it's got a uh, two, two procs so while you're on your ADC, you can kind of just uh, stack up your uh, your E procs. Boy needs help. Another E on him. So there's a there's kind of like a brand new like gameplay loop, very unique, nothing like anything else that's in the game. Uh, a lot of a lot of attaching and disattaching. Try to Q. Oh, right into the minion. So when we get to team fighting stage, guys. It's going to be a lot of mobility, because I'm going to be W-ing from teammate to teammate, baiting people into uh, wasting their spells on me, and then just, you know, retreating safely to the, uh, the safety of our teammate's shoulder. Alright, not bad, not bad. So, guys, uh, the max order is going to be Q... On to E. I don't think we want to put any points into our W. I don't see what that would uh, actually accomplish. Wow, that shield is actually uh, pretty heavy. The Q is very, very slow, and Yumi by herself is incredibly, uh, incredibly squishy. So, guys, like I said, a lot of the gameplay is just going to be you on the shoulder of your, uh, your ally. Oh, that is so much fun. That's definitely the most fun part of her, her kit so far, is guiding the Q around. So the Q works differently where your um the Q works differently when you're attached to your ally. And when you're unattached, it's just a straight line. And it's very, very slow. Q, you kinda it kind of follows your um your cursor around, you see like that? Point into E. Let's go, boys! I got an assist for literally just sitting on him. Let's see if we can hit her there. Oh, missed it. Yeah, a little bit of a learning curve with this Q. All right, so now this 2v1, I want to hop off here, get my spell thief procs on the turret. So I'm guessing my ally also sees that blue circle where that's the limit of the Q. All right, hilariously enough, guys, I'm safe. I'm safely attached to uh, to my Jin. Uh, Windows is trying to update my system, so I need to tell Windows that 
it's not a great time to update. And ironically, this is probably the best champion to ever have a Windows uh, update Genku because you are literally untargetable. You also share the back, I believe. So since, I, since I'm attached to him and he backs, boom, we're in the fountain, boys. Oh, that is actually so sick. All right, grab that. We're going to grab, not going to buy boots. As much as you want to buy boots. Uh, there's no real point in having boots because you share the movement speed of your ally. So look at that. We're just right back attached to him. And uh, if you guys haven't seen the uh, the ultimate, the ult is really, really nice. It's kind of like a combination between uh, like a Maokai ult and a Sona ult. Yeah, this is, as my Twitch chat is saying, this is the ultimate AFK champion. Boom! I think I hit her with that. I'm gonna do my own thing for a little bit. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, meow, meow. So when we're, uh, when we're, the passive of my W is that when I'm attached to, I gain 5% of each other's attack damage or ability power. So let's watch how much AD we're actually giving, uh, J. Ah, no. okay, bye. It looks like we give him not too much. If I build full AP, that's going to be a higher amount of AD. Yo, Derp Don, thank you for the two months up, buddy. Truly appreciate it, man. Tag him with that. We're gonna heal him up. We'll hop off of him. Yeah, so I want to get off as many autos as I- Oh, wow! I am really squishy. Wow, you- I was trying to bait out damage. Dude, that's a good lesson to learn, though. She is incredibly squishy. I took, like, two Kai'Sa autos and a Q, and I just instantly died. So we're going to be building uh, Athenes. And the more AP I get, the more AD. So it's kind of like Yumi acts as like an item. I put gold value onto whoever I'm attached to. Which would be really nice when we're in the team fighting stage and we're zipping around people, giving people adaptive. So if I'm on an AP mage, obviously I'm going to give them extra AP. If I'm on an AD mage, extra AD. AD mage? Jesus. Uh, an AD user. Well, that was, yeah, that was, uh, that's why you don't disattach very often, guys, because you straight up get blown up. Do you get more AP from W if you level it up? Um, I guess we'll find out, man. You are very squishy, but so cute. I am extremely cute. I am the cutest. Go get him, buddy. also gives a minor speed boost so you can kind of like control the speed of the person you're riding around we actually have peanut HP yeah I, we have an extremely small health pool I'm talking like I'm squishier than Sona who was previously the squishiest champion in the entire game I'm bro I'm out of here I'm going back home when we get level 5 uh, we are gonna be looking to do a hard engage but we're still reliant on our um, our teammate because it, we shoot it in one direction, and then it's coming out of the person that we're attached to. So, like, it's kind of like a Tarek stun. Jungler just entered. Classic. Ah! I'm scared! Dude, I am, I am legitimately scared whenever I see anyone out here. Oh, you can ward. You can ward while you're attached to people. People. So you can use actives, you can use your trinket, side stone. Boink. Nice little slow. I'm almost six, man. I need just a little bit. It's a slow. Oh, dude. Okay, so pretty nice combo with Jin, actually. Don't really have much to do other than just like shoot my lasers. Alright. Ah! Ah! Okay, it didn't quite... It has to hit them three times to uh, to root them, so... Oh, I took turret aggro. So that's the one thing that you, you aren't safe from when you're, uh, when you're on someone's shoulders. Is, uh, you can still take turret aggro. 
So that's kind of in place so you can't just like constantly... Like, Jin can't be here and I'm just like constantly queuing them. Beautiful. Yeah, I'm probably not going to be buying boots until like my third or fourth item. Like, I'm, I, there's so much better like gold value out of getting uh, utility items. I might try a, a full AP Yumi at some point, so guys, let me know down in the comments what you guys are building as Yumi, or uh, what you guys want to see me build as Yumi. Okay, okay. I got 1200 gold. I'm going back, man. Okay, so... I've, I've, I'm, uh, I'm ahead of Stone on how much gold I procced from uh, Spell Thieves, so... Got my fiends. Dude, I am re <laughs> I'm really slow when I'm not attached to someone though. Obviously, I don't have boots. Let's uh let's get a team fight going, man. I wanna I wanna zip around. Dude, she's so <sighs> I'm in love, man. I'm actually in love. This is definitely not the type of champion I usually play, but it's something like so new and unique to the game that like I can't help but really like her. And then I can zip around. Zip to her. No cost. Oh, that's so cool, dude. Heal for you. Oh. Alright, there's the root. Oh, gosh. Somebody help me. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna quietly uh, go ahead and leave. <laughs> Dude, you're actually like so vulnerable when you, when you aren't on someone. Alright, I think I'm gonna go back to uh, chilling with Jin. But. Take me to bot lane, peasant. No, you're going the wrong way. Somebody turn this train around. He said no. All right. Yeah, I'm not sure this is going to be like a really good champion for solo queue because obviously I'm just like joking around. But uh, solo queue is not necessarily known for like super cooperative teammates. Uh, and this champion seems to really rely a lot on. Uh, ouch. On a uh, coordinated play. Yeah, you you may need to hold you right. I got you, buddy. I do think she's gonna be a champion that's like really good in team fights though. When I've got a lot of bodies to uh to jump around from. Got him! I hit him! Wait, where am I? Okay. Hey, there we go, boys. Dude, it's kind of hard to, like, track where you're at. <laughs> Trendemir, what are you doing, bud? Oh, I almost got a kill. I almost got a kill. Alright, I'm going to dis disconnect just to get uh, some spell thieves on the... Uh turret yeah jumping from ally to ally it's really fluid it's really fun and it's really unique like that is the draw of the of this character essentially when you can actually like w to people slightly outside of the the, the range it feels like all right let's go ahead and start building redemption after redemption is when i'll probably buy my uh my boots but right now it just doesn't really seem like i need them They're gonna nerf that. They might, man. I mean, it's the, it's the entire purpose of the champion, though. The Q without being mounted um, is really, really lame. I'll tell you guys that right now. Look how slow it is. It does essentially no damage. And, uh, yeah. It's, it, you're very clearly meant to use your Q when you're mounted. Oh, let's go get her. I've got my ult. Go get her, go get her. So 
So even though he's stunned, I'm still um, still able to you know, act with agency and like use my own skills. Hmm. All right, Lee. I think I think I'm gonna go chill with my boy, my boy Jin, for a while. We're definitely gonna be best when we're uh, when we're grouped up, though. When I can when I can leap from person to person. This is when I'm going to be strongest. Gonna drop the ignite on her. Just keep healing my boy Jin. Leap to her. No, I want to kill, dude. Come on. All right, speed him up. Speed him up. Oh, nice shooting, boy. Very nice, man. All right. Ugh, I want to ward over that wall. Let me ward. Let me ward. There we go. Spell thieves. And back on the gen. Oh! You need to detach to uh, to drop turret aggro. Do I think flash is even worth it on her? Next game, I'm definitely gonna try to play without flash. And uh, see how it feels. Um, I just took Flash because that's how I know how to play the game. Uh, but the reality is, taking Ignite and Flash is actually, or Ignite and uh, Exhaust is probably going to be like one of the biggest draws to Yumi. So I think skipping Flash is definitely going to, uh, to be a viable thing. Oh, that's so cool. See, that's that's like Yumi. That's ideal Yumi is right there. Like when you shoot your Q and then your ally actually moves towards who you're trying to hit so that like the, uh, the range continues extending. Like that's that's ideal right there. Boy, Jan is invincible. I am running very low on mana. I'm gonna use one more there. I've got enough, I've only got enough for one more spell, guys. But I've got a lot of uh, mana regen. Boink. Oh, I'm out of mana. Give me blue buff, please. Uh, can I keep him alive? Can I keep him alive? I can, boys! It's happening! Holy boys. Uh, Morgana? Morgana! Not happy about that one. Not happy about that one. What if you attach? What if you attach Q and then attach to someone else? Can you still control your Q? Very good uh, question. I will figure that out right now. Morg, I am not happy with you. Get away from me. Uh, it looks like it... Well, it looks like it, the, the queue still keeps going, but I can't control it. It just, like, continues going off in the same direction. Alright, dude. I've... It, you're so rarely at 20 minutes into the game and not having boots. Like, I actually feel so hilariously slow right now. I do have 40% uh, CDR. Why aren't you happy? I'm just kidding, Morgana. I'm just kidding, buddy. It's all memes. So probably not going to be doing a lot of roaming with this champion, honestly. This is dead. Oh. Beautiful. Oops. There's a heal. Here, so there's a small cooldown for when you d detach and then reattach. As you can notice, there's a cooldown. Whoop. Oh god! Oh dear god! Oh, uh, should I go in on this? I'm coming, buddy! I'm coming, buddy! Let me W. Keep this guy healed 
up. Keep this guy healed up. I've been trying to KS so hard. I mean, not that hard. Ah! Alright, Morgana. Alright, that's how it's gonna be. That's how it's gonna be. You know what? You are an abusive pet owner. Oh, I, I take it all back! I take it all back! Guys, if she dies, I am so dead. So please don't die. I am permanently untargetable, dude. How, how nutty is this champion? How nutty is this? Oh, so close, man. I want to kill, man. I want a Yumi kill. So the longer the uh, the Q travels, uh, if it travels for one second, you see it does this little thing where I think it speeds up and it also, uh, after it travels for that, it slows for 70%. So it's actually a pretty intense heal, or a pretty intense slow. No, I'm not, it's, it's not worth it to go down there for, for blue. I don't need, I, I've got two mana items, man, I'm fine. Get up there. I wanna shoot. Oh, I'm not attached. It's not looking good, guys. It's not looking good. Well, maybe I'll just uh, slip out the back here. <laughs> yeah, they were. Uh, they were not having that. Let's five v five, boys. All right, I am gonna buy boots now. Uh, let's go ahead and grab these, and let's grab. I think you would just kind of want to get tanky boots, just in case uh, when you do get caught uh, unattached. And then I want to start building my ardent sensor. When you're attached and you use a barrier spell or a summoner spell, in, such as barrier, do you bury the ally instead of yourself? I don't think so. I think that uh, I think that probably would have been mentioned as an interaction. Oh man, they just got Baron. Alright, let's 5v5, boys. They've got a, they've got a pretty t strong team comp, and we've got first time Yumi, so. Oh, this can go over, I didn't know that, it can go over walls. Oh, that's really useful to know, actually. Alright, Trinomir is top. Doing dragon. What does her ult do? It is a. Uh, it sends out seven waves, and if three of them hit, it fruits. Wowzers. We are dropping like flies. Yeah, Trinomir is just gonna, like, permanently split with Baron now. Ah, there you go. This guy up. Let me to my boy Jin. Jin's my favorite to stay attached to so far. kind of spooky because you want to stay attached to the person that is in danger but if you if they die while you're attached to them you are like so boned oh, I think I got we got Sona where am I where am I okay <laughs> yeah I got I gotta get used to uh like actually staying aware to who you are attached to Nice, nice, nice. Oh, I got the soul on her. Oh, man. 
go to him while she's shooting. Go, 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 go. Oh, I got her slowed. I got her slowed. Beautiful, boys. We got the ace. Hey, let's run it down. Let's run it down. Right, we're going to detach. Get some spell thieves on the turret. Okay, run it down, boys. I got my ulti. I got my ulti, boys. I'm, re I'm ready for a big, big play. Big play. Who's ready for a big play? so bad man but it's so I it, like this champion does like so little damage getting kills on her is actually gonna be like really rare I think heal 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 jump to her shoot my thing <gasps> oh I thought I had it throw the redemption Jumping ship. Oh lord. Oh no. Guys, let's talk this out. Let's be gentlemen about this. Dude, I've got 26 out of 32 kill participation. So even though you're not getting a lot of kills, you are going to get a ton of assist with this champion, guys. Cool. Alright, we got our Ardent Center now as well. Try Medjai's. I'm going to do a full AP Mewmi uh, at another time. Right now I'm building what I think is actually going to be like probably the best build on Yumi. Oh my gosh. Trendomir turned into a Grom! Turned into a frog! Yumi Penta incoming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, I want a kill. <laughs> he said okay. Come with me. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, my boy Lee Sin's got me. Let's go on another adventure. So this champion's like, it's really unique. It's kind of relaxing. It's definitely like something we've never seen before in League of Legends. Uh, I know someone was saying it was similar to Abathur or something in Heroes of the Storm. So if you know what the heck they're even talking about is, uh, that is, let, let me know down in the comments. I've never seen anything like this in a game before. Oh. Lee Sin promises me a kill. You promised. You promised. Okay, 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 okay. Heal her up and then jump back to Lee Sin. I'm waiting for a uh, good time to um, use my ultimate. You can use it while... while uh, while not mounted on a teammate, but it's probably not a good idea. You'll probably just get deleted while you're trying to do that. This is so hard to engage in. Yeah, they've got like a really good team comp, actually. Oh, man. Ah! I, th I feel like he's trying to let me get a kill, but I just do so little damage that... Oh, beautiful man, he's a monster. Doink. 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 
I think we can end this here. We're gonna end without getting me a kill. You know what, dude? We didn't get killed, but 30, 30 assists is actually pretty crazy. I'm okay with getting 30 assists. Oh! That's all I got for you, man. That's all I got for you. Do I need to be abandoning ship here? Hey, triple on Jin. No! I'm coming. All right, Lee. Give me a kill, dude. Come on, buddy. I believe. <laughs> I do so little. There's no way I'm going to get a kill, man. But I'm having fun trying. <laughs> you tried, man. You tried. You will be remembered for your efforts. Hey, boys, guys, that is going to be the world's first deep gameplay of Yumi. Let me know what you guys think about the champion, the build, the strats, how heartbreaking it is that I never got a kill down in the comments. Take it easy. Peace.